Hello all of you awesome people out there and welcome back to another super awesome mega wicked cool video done by myself Disowned Hero and today we are on something a bit different to EVE Online. We are playing Armor 3 and it's a modded server, it's a zombie server. I've never been on this one before and to be honest I have not played Armor 3 for months and months and months and months. Honestly I can't remember the last time I played this so remember what the buttons are might be a bit of an issue but I believe this one should be a solo kind of server so it's not 100% team based and kind of run around on my own just get to grips with things shoot some zombies in the face and uh, maybe run into some other players so we'll just see how things go so we want to just simply spawn on the ground somewhere random and uh yeah, just be on our merry merry way now do we actually start with anything okay we start with very very basic kind of supplies here There we go. So let's just uh, let's just head off. We've at least got a map. So where where are we? Where am I in all of this? Is that me? Okay. Apparently I'm supposed to be getting to here. So um, that's going to be a little bit of a little bit of a mission, but uh, should be doable. Let's see if we can find a car or something. There should be some players here, I'd imagine as well, with uh, you know all of these kind of kind of things about. And obviously we have zombies. There's one there. Walking around and I have no weapons, so I think the first thing we need to do is find a weapon. And to be honest, I can't remember the last time I actually played a custom server. I'm used to just playing like the normal game, like the official server, so I can't actually remember where you get weapons from. <laughs> Apparently that's a weapon. Oh, I'll, I'll have that. Let's take my... Okay, there we go. We'll take my bubble hat on. We'll have the police berry on instead. And, um... Yeah, we'll just go exploring for a bit. I don't know how much of this I'm going to chop and change and cut out. I don't know, because obviously if I play it for hours and hours and I'm just running around lost, it might be a bit boring for you guys. I thought I heard something there. might be a bit boring for you guys, but uh, obviously I'll try and make it as interesting as I can. Let's have a bulletproof vest, shall we? Here we go. Pistol, thank you. I'll take that. And obviously we'll definitely have the... Uh, Magazines as well. Give me all of them. Can I, can I take them all? I'll just take all button down there. I'm an idiot, aren't I? Right, so at least we can now fire back at things. Uh, let's go in this way here. And yeah, we're now free to go roam about. Oh. Nope. <laughs> I've never played a zombie map on this before, so I, honestly, I don't know how the zombies kind of work, how they react or anything. I don't know if they, I don't even know if they run, or if it's just a simple case of so they kind of wander about. Now I don't really want to fall down. I'm gonna get some damage on it. I wonder if we can drop down there. Let's jump. I forgot how to vault over things. I forgot all of the buttons so we can lean obviously we can run we've got lie down kneel stand up uh we've got a map we have a compass uh I've, I've completely forgot the button to jump so that might be a little bit of an issue right so we're just gonna have to fight our way down i think let's go see if there's anyone down here the problem with just like firing blindly at things Oh, at least one headshot's enough to kill them. Problem of firing blindly at things, obviously it makes a lot of noise. Other players will know I'm here. And also I think the zombies will be attracted to me as well. My mouse sensitivity is a little bit off. We'll take that. Oh, wait. Uh, no, we'll keep the bulletproof vest on. I'm not sure what the bulletproof vest does. But let's just keep uh, that on. Sounds better, doesn't it? Then a little bit of a harness. Right, so let's go see what we can find. There was another zombie, there was two of them, there was definitely two. And I've just spotted at the bottom of the screen now we have to actually eat and drink. So we have to keep an eye out for food and water and things. But in the meantime, let's just run blindly until we actually find something a little bit interesting. Now they seem to have got rid of... Do I have a stamina? Usually you have a stam stamina bar at the top right on like the standard game about mods and stuff. 
I don't need to have one. I wonder if I can just sprint like indefinitely. Anything in there? What? Why? What is the jump button? I'm gonna have to Google that, aren't I? What's the jump button? Give me a sec. Let's get near safe. Let's see if we can find out what that button is. What's this first? Ooh, head cap. A lot better than the one we've got on. Yeah, give me a sec, guys. Oh, God, there were so many buttons. I forgot. I think it might be V. There we go. It is. It's V. Let's jump up and down. So at least now we can start vaulting over fences and stuff if we need it. Um... There is about 20 other people playing, but obviously the map, if we look at it, is pretty huge. So where people are, I have no idea. What is this here? Don't know. Uh, we're here. We've got a dummy thing next to us. No idea what that dummy thing is, but I'm going to go for it. So it's uh, directly behind us and like kind of south, uh, southwest. Let's just head that way. Swing. Kind of, what's my compass again? There it is. Kind of southwest. It's kind of this way so let's go see if we can find go away go away there we go so let's go see if we can find this dummy and then figure out what that thing is oh wait i think i figured it out is the dummy simply where i started apparently it is it's right here yeah, it mustn't be anything important. Maybe it's like a starting area for players. All right, so that's a bit of a waste of time. Now let's head further into the city. Let's go towards petrol stations and stuff. See if we can find ourselves a vehicle. Not too many zombies or anything. Which obviously is a good thing. Yeah, I seem to be able to sprint further now, which I don't know how I feel about that. I like the fact that in the normal games, you have no mods or anything. You were kind of limited to your sprints. So you couldn't just like it random, 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 absolutely everywhere. But at the same time, I'm presuming if you get a load of zombies kind of with you, then you would kind of want to be able to, to sprint about. So which way was this petrol station? It was right here. Let's try and keep off the main road. Bust into some more houses, shall we? See if we can find any more goodies. Oh, is that water? Empty plastic bottle, yeah. I'm pretty sure we can fill that up at some point. Empty in here. I'm going to close the doors behind me so hopefully I'll hear anyone or anything coming in behind me. What have we got here? Another hat. Lots of hats and stuff, isn't there? I'm not really bothered about the hats. Where's my mouse gone? I've lost my mouse. Oh, no. There we go. So I exited. I somehow managed to exit. My mouse managed to get out of the screen. How strange. Right. Let's just keep going, shall we? Ah, no fall damage. Nice. I like the fact that the music keeps picking up. Why have I got combat signals in the right hand side? Uh, received a person's paycheck of 100 something, something, remember to bank it or something. God knows. Music's kicked up though, it's got a little bit, a little bit dancey, a little bit more funky. Let's see if we can. Why is V jump? I'm gonna have to change our line. It's a bit stupid on V is jump. Makes a lot more sense having spaces jump. I'm stuck in here now. How do I get out? Is this open? Oh, thank you. Right, so this petrol station then. Here it is. Uh, any vehicles here which we could maybe... No, nothing. Okay then. I keep hitting, I keep hitting space to jump. Wait, what? There we go. <laughs> Uh, I'm actually going to stick with the smaller pistols because I have more ammo for it. We'll take that with us as well. What else do we have here? No, I'm going to stick with my little pistol. 
So again, I've not played it ages. I'm not really sure the difference between the guns. I'm pretty sure they all act pretty much the same. It's not like we're playing Fortnite where one gun's like show one shot killer and another pistol's like, bah. So you might as well be flicking, flicking your boogies at them. Right, so I'm a little bit unsure where to go now. Let's head. Oh, I don't know. All right, we're supposed to be heading towards. Let's zoom out a bit. We're supposed to be heading to this mission here. So this is kind of where we want to get to. Oh, lots of chance. I just want that for me. Oh, I don't know. Let's put that there. Um, but on our way, what can we actually go past? We definitely need a vehicle. That's far, far too far away to be going all on our lonesomes. Um, I was going to scout around and see if we can find ourselves a car. So we're definitely going to need some sort of transportation. All right, so a little bit of progress. We have found. What is? Whoa! What are you? No! 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 What are you? I've found some better clothing, and I've also found a shotgun, which I think will be. Whoa! <laughs> what are you doing? Oh my god! Uh-oh. The noises! Oh crap, there's two of them. Ah! Why would he die? That was like, how many shots of a shotgun was that then? I got one. I'm gonna get them square in the head. I've gotta get them square in the head. Oh. You're dead. Is it dead? Harness. I already have a harness. Any better than this one? No idea. Let's just switch them over anyway. Just take it, please. Oh, okay. Leave it then. Um, you have anything cool on you? Just another harness. Okay. Not interested. Where's my mouse gone? I keep managing to get my mouse outside of the game. I have no idea how I keep doing that. Crap, there's another one. Yeah, I do not want to be outside at night time if they're the kind of things that are going to be crawling around. So I'm just going to hold up. Actually, this, this little place seems to be boarded off quite well. So I'm just going to hold off in here for the night. And we'll wait for those um, those backwards crawlers to uh, essentially sod off. So we've got a nice room somewhere with a couple of doors. So a door here. There is a door here. Close it then. Yeah, we're just going to wait here, I think, until it becomes daytime. And uh, we'll take it from there. Uh oh. No, please don't say you're coming in here. I just got to kind of. Presume that if they can't see me, I'm safe. No! Those things are freaky. They are freaky. Oh, he's coming in, isn't he? He is so coming in here. Why? He is as well. Crap. Come on then. I'm ready for you. I'm a little bit cornered in here if he does come in. I mean, there's a back door just there. But that's not ideal. Oh, is that is that daytime? I did actually forget I do have night vision. But uh, oh crap! Oh, 
Oh my god, is there any more? I am I am so low on ammunition. How did he open a door? <laughs> He's like falling around on his hands. Wow, this is actually a little bit scary. I wasn't expecting it to be. How come every time I enter this menu I lose my mouse? There it is. I saw even a door. I was quite lucky I didn't try and get out there, isn't it? Because it's uh it's just a window. Alright, it's not not daytime. So let's just go back. And then hold off. Alright, so we've actually been sitting here for what feels like a lifetime, staring at that gate, just flashing the old uh, night vision on. Oh, something's just spawned next to me. <laughs> flashing the old night vision on every now and then. Nothing else has come in. I thought I heard a few things, but it was it was nothing. It is now 25 to 7, so it should, in theory, start getting day any time now. I'm going to have to go and find some water because we are getting a little bit dehydrated. And now uh, hopefully we don't run into any more of those weird backwards crawly things because they are just freaky. I don't want to be running into, into many of them. I keep getting these, it just popped up there, I keep getting these random prisoner paychecks. I have no idea what they are, how to use them. So um, yeah, we're just going to leave them as they are for now. It looks like, looks like we are generally, generally okay, I think. We've got the shotgun out just in case. We're definitely gonna need some more ammunition. Didn't even think of checking the back, you know. I don't think there's any other way in here. I'm pretty sure this, like, was a bit of an enclosed compound and I kind of looted through it. Let's just see what, what has managed to kind of spawn up here. I mean, there's a lot of these. Range Master belts. I already have one. Five items inside. Got a wrench. Oh, we started with a pistol. Well, that would have been fun to know, wouldn't it? I uh, got a plastic bottle and a few other bits and pieces. We've got no binos. But uh, to be honest, I'm pretty sure we'll live. Just want to toy up and be daytime now. And there we go. It is now officially. Daytime, I was starting to get freaked out then I was hearing noises. I'm not sure if it's the wind or bloody birds or something, but it's uh, obviously an active server and over half the population voted for daytime, so it just suddenly became bright. Although, what time is it? 11 o'clock. Unless it's 11 o'clock in the evening. Hell of a long night cycle. Oh, they could have actually come in over there. Uh, Behind us over there. Okay, so I really wasn't watching like the enemy way in or out. So where was I actually heading? That's right, I was looking for a car and I was going to head towards... Oh, I don't even know where cars would be. Let's try and get back to this main road, shall we? And just follow the main road a little bit. So I want to kind of be going east. Um, so this way. Got to look at the keyboard. I'm not used to using all these keys. And even online, there's like four buttons you push and that's it. I feel like I can hear something. How strange. Shotgun might come in handy, but to be honest, it's definitely a close range weapon. I could have sworn there was a hole in the wall here. There it is. It's definitely a close range weapon. Which obviously isn't a bad thing when they're at close range, but I'd like to take things out before they actually got too close to me. Some cars there, no, they're all battered, aren't they? Uh, never had search bins or anything. Not quite sure what I have to do to get their attention. Is it just a case of if I can, if they can see me, they're gonna come over? Whoa. Okay, I'm going. Where's the shotgun gone? All right. So it turns out that yes, some of these are runners. How many flipping headshots do you take? Uh oh. Ah, oh, that's not good. I'm out of bullets for everything. Run away! Freedom! We need a car. We need to run into other players. We need some help. How do I look back? Oh, I'll use these zeros. Look back. 
It's not now. I've got absolutely nothing here. I have got nothing. I'm going to die. I don't want to die. I've not long started. Uh, we're on the main road. Let's just go this way. I don't know how long they're going to actually chase for. Why can't I look behind me? It should be the number two. Oh, they've changed it. It's there now. Right, so we are a little bit faster than them, which is kind of cool. I should really figure out which button melee is. Oh, not very often are melee things. I seem to be getting a little bit tired. I'm all grunty grunty. Okay, now I, now I don't feel um, too much like I'm cheating for having an infinite run. Right, we're going to have to go. We're going to have to break line of sight, aren't we? Let me in, let me in, let me in. Oh, come on. I should be able to vault that. Oh, yeah, we do. We just need to break line of sight. All right. All right. So we need to, like, ring around the rosy somewhere, don't we? Getting it in. Shut the door. Oh, this might have been a mistake. We'll just take a seat. We are incredibly thirsty and hungry now. Just trying to peek out that window a little bit if I can. Get out of aiming. What is this? Please be ammunition of some sort. Do you fit in that? No, you don't. I need ammunition. I don't need that. I will, I will drink that, though. Ah, uh, so it will take it all anyway. And then we'll have uh, a nice swig. Oh, come on, just use it. I forgot the button to use things. There we go. We got our first up a little bit. Is he, he's, I'm guessing that he's just going to be standing there, isn't he, waiting? Oh no. He's gone. We lost him. Right, I want to go straight. I want to go the opposite way to where you I thought I was going to go in here. We need to do some more. We need to find some ammunition. Absolutely nothing. We've got a zombie there. I don't think we're close enough to him to be uh, of any any real threat to us. We're kind of moving outside of the town now. I was finding nothing at all. Just clothes upon clothes upon clothes. So if we ever needed to change of clothes, we will definitely head back there. But for ammunition and stuff, we were getting nowhere. And since I am not the best shot in the world, we kind of need as much ammunition as we can carry. Please be bullets. Oh, a box of screws. No idea what they're for. It's going to leave them there. All right, where was that zombie? Oh, crap. Is he, uh, do they all run? Hmm, maybe he's not seen us. Let's just head this way to this house. I'm not sure if they're all runners or if some of them are just, like, slow walkers. Ammunition. More clothes. Oh, there's a belt or something there. What's that? Uh, we'll take that in case we ever find a gun that needs it. But right now, it's not of much use to us. Where is he? It sounds close. Unless there's another one. All right, let's go to the next house. Let's just keep going. There's not much we can do. We can't exactly just keep running forever. And... Wow, maybe I've just got the... I've got the game turned way too loud. It sounds like they are literally right next to me. I'm quite lucky, actually. I haven't found any inside any buildings. I'll take you as well. 
Once we get away from these zombies, we might see if it's possible to maybe put these bullets inside of a... Uh... Oh, it's all... I don't know how to... Yeah, we'll leave that. I'm not messing around with un uncooked food and dirty water. Alright, let's just... Where are we? Let's head towards this hill up here. Let's go get... I don't know, let's just get away from like populated areas. Hopefully there'll be less zombies this way. And I wonder, can is there any way of oh, there's eight rounds there? Can I not? That's empty. Can I not just refill it? Oh, what the hell's that? Oh no, but I'm running. That does sound like it's right next to me though, guys. But guessing you're the same, you must be hearing them like they are literally on top of me. God knows. Uh, let's, let's check this building out here. Nothing's running towards us, which is good. If they're just walking, we can easily kind of just like joke around them, slip by. It's if we get enough one of those runners, they can kind of chase us for... Well, there's nothing in here. <laughs> kind of chase us for a fair while before we can actually... Is that a car? That's a car. Oh, yes, we're in business if that's a car. Oh, you're not going to work, are you? Are you? No, you... Uh... Oh, he is as well. Yes, right, so where are we heading? Petrol. Okay, let's, let's head west, just directly west. Let's go and get ourselves some... Uh, was that west? No, it was east, wasn't it? Let's go get ourselves some... Whoa, this thing handles like a potato! Dragon to the right. Dragon always, to be honest. Let's find this road. Let's get rid of that compass for me flipping onto my face. Go away! There we go. Let's go see if we can't... Probably easier like this, actually. We can't get ourselves some... See if we can get this refilled. Uh, yeah, let's not go off road the... Ah, the whole way. You wouldn't think it, but I do actually have my uh, full driving license. Oh, wait, is that going to take us... Yeah, let's, let's not head back to the main road. Let's follow this like, little dirt track here. Let's see where this goes. There's another car up there as well. Right, might be able to find some lootage here. Yeah, let's go see. Let's go see what we can find here. I don't know how to put my gun away, by the way. In case you're wondering why I've still got my gun out. I don't know how to put it away, so it's just gonna be it's gonna be out forever. Alright, that's empty. Was it two doors inside that little shack? It's a bit weird. I wasn't there a second ago. One of these Playboy things around. How strange. Right, we need we need guns and ammunition, food and water. We don't actually do. It. Oh, there we could do with water. Is this water? <gasps> Wonder if I can use that as a weapon. No. Empty bottle. Oh, put him in there. I don't quite know what I'm supposed to do with empty bottles. What are the chances there's going to be zombies in here? Oh, you can't open them. You could well have a few jump scares in there. Right, there's got to be some goodies in here. Absolutely nothing. Where is everything? Might be any, do we have a trader somewhere? Is there a trader? Am I supposed to be buying things? There's a market down there. Oh, there's one up there. We're quite a way away from that though. 
Uh... Alright, we're going to have to head somewhere, aren't we? So I'm just going to keep looting. We're going to follow this main road up. And we'll see if we can't maybe swing by. It's not even swing by. We are miles away from anything. How long have I been going for? I've been recording for an hour and it's going to be a very kind of short video. But I'm going to call it... I'm going to call it a night. We're also being kicked off the server for some reason. It's being restarted. It's a bit weird. But uh, it's actually perfect timing then, isn't it? So, yeah, we're going to call it um, a qu so quits here. This space, I just wanted to mess around on a different game other than EVE Online tonight. And I haven't been on Armour 3 for ages. That's exactly why I went for it. So, yes, I am extremely rusty. I don't have any friends who play Armour 3, although I am trying to get EVE vacations. I mentioned it to him um, to start playing with me, do like a little co-op. Um, well, I wouldn't say stream, but, you know, few videos on it so maybe that will come in the future but other than that guys let me know what you thought of this game i'll probably play it a few more times even if it's not on camera i'm just going to keep on top of it because uh it's generally quite scary i mean i know it's probably watching it you're like well there's obviously resident evil games are scary and there's other there's other like scarier games out there and this is just a, a, a combat simulator kind of game but that was generally quite scary especially those upside down backwards zombie things did make me kind of sweat just a little bit. So, yeah, I'm just going to leave it there, guys. If you like this video, hit the like button down below. And I'll see you right here very soon in another video. Bye-bye. If you did enjoy this video, don't forget to hit the like button and hit the subscribe button as well to get some more game guides, how-tos, let's plays, and live streams from myself. I also think you should check out this video just up here. But if that one doesn't interest you, then try this one. Other than that, guys, take it easy, and I'll see you soon.